corn was completely unknown in Europe, Asia, or Africa before the 16th century after the Spanish brought it over to Europe from the New World. They didn't call it corn, but rather maize. The word maize comes from a word of the Taino people of the Caribbean, maiz. Although we are not sure what island exactly, it was presumably somewhere in the northern Antilles near San Salvador. The word maiz to the Taino meant source of life. To them, corn was a staple food as it is to many of us today. The Spanish did not change the name, they only transmuted it to maiz, which became maize in English. To understand how maize came to be called corn, first think about all the food words that have corn in them, but have nothing to do with the grain maize. Peppercorns, for instance, are the dried berries of the Piper nigrum plant, nothing to do with maize. And have you ever wondered about corned beef? There's no corn in it, so how is it corned? Well, although some sources will tell you that corn was a word for any type of grain, it was actually a word meaning small nugget. And if you think about it, grain can mean the same thing. We have a grain of sand or a grain of salt. It's actually applied to any small particle. Corn was really the same kind of thing, except it has the connotation of something that is ground down into small particles. The original meaning of the word though survives in very few words that we still have today. Peppercorn, for instance, referring to the small berries of the pepper vine is obvious. In corned beef, which I mentioned before, it refers to the beef being rubbed or preserved with corns or grains of salt. And unknown except to skiers is corn snow, which refers to a granular coarse type of snow. The English word kernel is also related to corn and comes from a diminutive Old English form of the word. Originally, when applied to cereal grains, terms like wheat corn or barley corn were used, but corn would tend to be applied to the leading grain of a region. So in England, corn was wheat or wheat corn. In Scotland and Ireland, corn was oats. Although the original maize name was retained when corn was brought to Europe, in some places, people did not know that it was from the New World. So names like Welsh corn, uh, Asiatic corn or Turkish corn were sometimes used. Applying Turkish, Turk, or Turkey to an exotic food was quite common, as when the Turks had invaded Europe, they had brought over many new foods, and they did this so often that any new food was assumed to be of Turkish origin. But applying an Asian origin to foods was pretty much the same idea. These were exotic and unknown lands full of exotic and unknown foods. So now we know how the word corn was used in Europe, but when the so-called pilgrims from England settled in the New World, they used the catch-all term for any type of grain and applied it to maize, calling it Indian corn. When corn came to be such an important part of the U.S. food production, the Indian part was left behind and the word corn eventually became a legal term applied to maize.